the mayor of Chicago, Brandon Johnson, was asked some questions about uh, uh, all the illegals in the Windy City. I, why are people all of a sudden yeah. so upset about illegal aliens? Huh. <laughs> That's very strange. These are all welcoming people in sanctuary cities. Hey, come here. We'll provide you sanctuary. We'll protect you from the mean, mean federal government. We'll let you uh, stay here as long as you want. We'll give you citizenship, in fact, basically. I mean, you won't really be citizens, but we'll treat you like them. In fact, we'll treat you better than our citizens. That's a fact. How about that? That is a fact. Anyway, uh, here's Brandon Johnson. I wanted to know if there is a capacity <laughs> limit and what is what is that limit if there is one and what is why can't we close the borders of Chicago or the state of Illinois in the first place? Why can't we close the borders? Wow. I don't know if there's a limit. I do know that when you are seeking asylum, uh -huh. you are granted protections from the U.S. to not return. So that is the process that folks are going through when they come here, when they get their interview, and then the Texas governor sends them to Illinois, and specifically Chicago. So they get to come, once they do an interview in Texas, they get to come regardless. Texas says, you're an asylum seeker, you're being persecuted, so yeah, you can leave your country and come here and go not, wherever you want. Not Texas. Not Texas. This right. is the federal government Thank is you. the one that does the process around asylum seeking. Thank you. It's Texas yes. who is making the decision to send them to Chicago. And that, that's what I wanted to know. Can and we say, no, we pause don't it for a second. anymore. And they've done that so that you can feel our pain. Yes. Finally feel our pain. And you don't like it one little bit, do you? <laughs> you don't like it. Oh, this is stunning. I mean, seriously, this worked way beyond anybody's wildest imagination. This, yep. uh, thank you, Greg Abbott, for this. If nobody else will say it, I will. Thank you for this, because this has woken up. You talk about being woke. <laughs> This country is now woke to the illegal immigration situation. Let's see what else she had to say. Send them to Chicago. And that, that's what I wanted to know. Can and we say, no, we won't take anymore? It has to come from the federal government. Okay. <laughs> no, okay. That's not, not true. Really, that's but not true. So yeah. that, that was last kind week. Of. We have an update, Pat. Oh, if, do we? Yeah, yeah. That uh, okay. Mayor Brandon, who is surrounded by Chicagoans, who clearly aren't pleased with the new additions to their uh, city. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, he just quietly um, signed a $26 million contract with a, a security firm that's going to build a migrant camp, mi multiple migrant camps oh. in Chicago. At taxpayer expense, of course. Uh -huh. So good, 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 good. That's awesome. I bet they'll be pleased with him, Your right? leaders are so listening to you, ma'am. Oh, my gosh. Well, they're already here. What are you going to do? <laughs> Sure. I mean, I have a company that's able to build them a place to survive and mm -hmm. live. Oh, the jobs. Think about that. Mm -hmm. The jobs. Yeah. Talk about people or places to mm -hmm. live. You've got that um, uh, that Colony Ridge there in Liberty County just outside Houston that's finally getting some attention. We talked about it here a probably a year ago. ago. Yes, when they were clearing right. land. And you've got now Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick saying, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try to figure out how to legally approach this. So we'll see. How uh, would Mexico handle this, I wonder? No, they need to f fulfill uh, a form. Right. They need okay. to establish their so, right name. The right we name. analyze if they have not uh, criminal precedents. Do Mexican mm. police go around asking for papers of people they suspect are oh, illegal of immigrants? Course. Of, of course. course. If somebody sneaks of in course. from Nicaragua, sure. some other country sure. in Central America, through the southern yeah. border uh -huh. of Mexico, they wind up mm -hmm. in Mexico, they can go get a job, they no, can no, work. No, no, if somebody do no. that if without permission... That. We send, ba we send back them. We send back yeah, them. Down there, if they do that without <laughs> permissions, we send back them. Wait, what? <laughs> what happened to your inclusion yeah. and your tolerance and your love for humanity? I mean, they're humanity? barely okay with <laughs> the convoys coming through the country now. Right. You know what I mean? We're there. We're, yeah, yeah. We're shipping all the people. Oh, yeah. We had know, to twist their arms Mexico. to get that done. Yeah. <clears throat> so, uh, I mean, welcome to our world. Mm -hmm. Everybody, welcome. What, 50,000 just the past week alone? Yeah. Is I mean, out of control. Completely out of control. 7 million during the <clears throat> Biden presidency. And 10,000 a day just at Eagle Pass. Oh. Just 
at Eagle Pass. It has to stop. So it has to. KJP was asked oh. about those reports uh, yesterday, and here's what she had to say. You know it's eloquent. You know that really? that much. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Green. So what do you call it what do you call here it? at the White House when 10,000 people illegally cross the border mm-hmm. in a single day? So what do you call it? Peter, what, what when do you GOP call it, puts forth a, a, a wait, no, 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 you can't. Green? I'm answering. Okay, we're gonna move you're on. No, 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 no. We're moving on. We're moving. In the back. Yeah, you said you're moving on. Wait, no, no. I tried to right answer, right? Peter. Okay. I tried to answer the question. You stopped me. No, Let's you start. did not. You tried to ask him a question yes. rather than answering his question. Oh, <laughs> Mm. I know. She saw it as an uh, opportunity to get away with, with move on yep. without having to address it. Oh, no, I'm yep. offended, so I'm moving on. Oh, shut up. Mm. Can we... Mm. Wait, what? Yes. Can we just maybe... I, you know, I, 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 we know that she is uh, known for her fashion. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. And we put her picture back up on the screen, please, because is that like the Ronald McDonald suit? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, are there clown oh, yeah, the, shoes on? It's kind of orange motto? and yellow. That's but cool. I don't know. Just I'll bet that's a twenty five hundred dollar <laughs> absolutely outfit right there. Uh, at absolutely, least. maybe thirty five hundred. And she, I mean, she, the money we pay her, of course, of course she can. Oh. I'd be interested. We've talked about it before, but I would like to know. Oh no, she's provided who provides a wardrobe. her. You wardrobe. know that yeah. that's the case. Mm. Yeah, she has to be. Yeah, right. There's no because way. it's part of her job, so I'm sure they provide her the wardrobe. I'm but surprised it's they crazy. don't roll credits at the end. Stu is, I know, I know. <laughs> Stu has kind of uh, tracked this a- along the way, noting that I think he says she's never worn the same thing twice. I believe that. In a, yeah. what, a year and a half now? Uh, she's never worn the same thing twice. That's pretty amazing. That is, and, and it's, and it's, it's. I am surprised that there is no credit somewhere. I mean, why... Mm-hmm. These companies uh, or a company is providing her a wardrobe without any kind of, hey, thank you. Yeah. We, I mean, we appreciate That Louis wouldn't make Vuitton any sense for, for a yeah. company. Wouldn't make any sense. Uh, you would have to say something about right. it. Right. You know, in order for it to be worth it for them. But... What, what, what was it know. after the game shows when you talk about rolled credit? Yeah. Was it like a, a yes. Mark Goodson? They pro- always. Provided by <laughs> yeah, they Mark Christian Goodson. Dior. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah, they always give roll the credits. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's awesome. Yep. Uh, so yesterday, KJP was a little snippy. Mm-hmm. And she continued to be snippy uh, when she was asked about the border. How many people coming into this country illegally is enough for President Biden? Nah. Say that last time. How many people come? How many people illegally coming into the United States is enough for President Biden? Well, enough 5. for what? 5.9 million people have been I, encountered no, I know, illegally. I know the numbers, but enough okay. for what? Enough to stop enough, it. Just to stop. Enough to stop well, it. As I mentioned, this is a problem that's been around for some time now. For yeah, decades. it's worse. A broken system. Do you understand? Oh, it's a broken system. <laughs> Jeez, it is thought, so much worse. Is that the first time she's admitted that it's a broken system? Yeah, they, they always I thought talk it, about the border. Was, the border was secure. Yeah. 